is awesome. He's got some cool, cool color to him. What's up, everybody? It's Paul the Inventory King. How you guys doing? We're in the fish room. We got another fish for the monster tank here in the fish room. And uh, this is gonna be awesome. Another addition. And I uh, got this guy from James Largo. So let's go ahead, get him over here. Start acclimating. All right, so while we're waiting, going to feed these guys and uh, they do this grazing, which is awesome. So let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, so I, I picked up these monster pellets. They're nine millimeter pellets. And uh, I give them to the fry because it gives them something to graze on. So I'm gonna let those settle. Let's go ahead and uh, we're gonna get one and two. Then we need to do the same on this side. Alright, so check this out. I don't know, I think that is super awesome just to see them going berserk. This is some Lepturus Green. But yeah, look at that. Just swarming around it. <laughs> That's rad. I think that's super awesome. Okay, let's go ahead down over here and check these. Oh boy, look at these ones, just swarming. <laughs> that's insane. It's just something fun to look at. And once this breaks down, I'm sure that these other ones are gonna also be able to get in on, on the action. Look at that up there, guys. <laughs> Those are the greens. Look at that. Just swarming that thing. <laughs> that is insane. All right, let's check out the hawks. S same story. Now, you got all of those guys just swarming this one piece, and then these uh, few that are there by themselves. That's incredible. I think that's awesome. And it breaks down for sure. You know, it gets soft, and, they're, and then it's going to be, you know, in the water column, and they're going to all get the food. But... This is something that's really great because it's something for them to graze on until it's gone. <laughs> that's nuts. I 
I got to get these guys into uh, one of these. I'm going to have to move these guys to a tank and those guys to a tank. Move these guys up in here. Red Bulu points. All right, let's get this one out. Trusty scissors, a little bit of cutting. There we go. Yeah, the knife and the uh, red pike are just chilling behind that rock. Here we go. Woo, jumping. That thing, that is so cool. That is an awesome looking fish. Get it in the tank. All right, check out this dude. Black striped pike. This dude is gonna be so awesome. Man, look at him. You got those two scaredy cats. And then you got this beautiful, beautiful black striped pike. Man, look at him. There it is, the black striped pike, just chilling. Look at those dudes. <laughs> this guy is gonna be an absolute monster. This guy will get 16 inches as well as the red pike. It's gonna be awesome to see these guys grow. Man, look at that guy. Man. Man, what a stud of a fish. That is an awesome pike. The black stripe pike. This dude's cool, man. Oh yeah, okay, let's let's go. He's swimming out right now. Let's take a look. There it is. I think I'm going to pull the rock out so that we can see them all. All right, so I got that I got that rock out for now until I get, you know, some substrate stuff figured out. There's the uh, stripe pike and give you guys a look at the gold spotted knife and the red pike. You guys are just chilling. This is awesome. I'm really enjoying having these fish and Expanding on the hobby. Uh, obviously, they're gonna be even better once they get more comfortable as each day goes on. Uh, but that black striped pike down over there is looking awesome. And uh, we got, I call them the scaredy cats right now because they kind of just always hiding away. I don't know. That's what they do. What did you guys think of that fish? Good? Give it a thumbs up if you think so. Also comment down below if you can share the video, that'd be awesome. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and notification bell because you're not gonna wanna miss out when we got more stuff happening to this tank. More is happening. So, yeah, notification bell. Don't miss out on anything in here in all these tanks and the salt tank. Don't forget, we got a salt tank coming up as well. Thanks everybody and stay tanked.